So this is a great Thousand Island dressing. Some people use it for hamburger spread or for a dipping sauce to uh, dip roasted potatoes or french fries. That's always good. So first you'll need to boil your egg and here's how. Place an egg into water and bring to a boil. A full rolling boil. Then cover the pan and turn off the heat. Leave it alone for about 20 minutes. After 20 minutes you'll have the perfect boiled egg. Then roast your bell pepper. To do that, simply place a red bell pepper on the open flame of your range. Keep turning it, please use tongs, until it's blistered and blackened. Then place it into a plastic bag and just, you know, twist the top so the air can't come out. After about five minutes or so, the peel can easily be pulled off the pepper. It may be hot, so be careful not to burn yourself. Cut off some of the bell pepper and mince about a tablespoon. Use the rest of the bell pepper for bruschetta. And by the way, I do have a video for that. Then use one rounded tablespoon of grated onion. After that, you're going to peel your egg and send it through a sieve or strainer. It's gonna look like this. The ingredients in your Thousand Island spread are mayonnaise, ketchup, white wine vinegar, grated onion, dill relish, salt, cayenne pepper, boiled eggs, and roasted red pepper. I'll give you a list of the measurements at the end of this video. I like to measure out all my ingredients into separate bowls so I don't forget and leave something out by mistake. So place all the ingredients into a bowl and simply mix them together. Chill overnight to let all the delicious flavors mingle. I put mine into a plastic container with a snap-on lid and it'll last for several weeks in the refrigerator. Not only can you use this dressing for salads, it can be used as a sandwich spread or a secret sauce for hamburgers. It's simply delicious and I hope you'll make it. For other easy recipes, please subscribe below to In the Kitchen. Thanks and have a really great day. Bye now.